Hey everyone, Alien Theory here with a quick video for today. This is something I'm really excited to share and talk about. Back in April, Alien Day to be exact, Dark Horse Comics teased an upcoming comic claiming more information will come in July. Well, it's July now and the rumors of the content of this comic have indeed been confirmed. Today, through an exclusive announcement made through CBR.com, Dark Horse announced it is officially adapting William Gibson's lost screenplay to Alien 3. The series will be adapted for the page by writer and artist Johnny Christmas. Now, the Gibson screenplay has become something of a legend over the years, and needless to say, with the abundance of production problems that plagued Alien 3, there were many stories that got passed over, or changed completely, or just lost into the vast nothingness. But Gibson's screenplay has always been much revered, and always had its fans, and had many lamenting the fact that it never got to be realized into film form. And I suppose a comic book adaptation is the next best thing. Along with the announcement, Gibson himself weighed in, stating the following. When your first contracted screenplay, or screenplay of any kind in my case, isn't produced, but the film is eventually made with a different screenplay, retaining nothing of yours but a barcode tattoo on the back of a character's neck, the last thing you expect is to see yours beautifully adapted and realized decades later in a different medium by an artist of Johnny Christmas's caliber. It's a wonderful experience, and I have no doubt that Johnny's version, which adheres almost entirely to the script, delivers more of my material to the audience than any feature film would have likely to do. If you're unfamiliar with the Gibson screenplay, its focus is on Hicks and Bishop, while Ripley is in a coma for most of the story, and if I remember correctly, I think they just shipped Newt away to her grandma's house or something, so she's not a big part of it. It is very much a Hicks and Bishop-centered alien story, which is very interesting. This is the official synopsis from Dark Horse. Following the deadly events of aliens, the Union of Progressive Peoples intercepts the spaceship carrying the hibernating bodies of Ripley, Hicks, Newt, and Bishop. But unbeknownst to them, they have also picked up another deadly passenger whose discovery will unleash a race between two governments to weaponize the Xenomorph in this horrifying and poignant Cold War-themed thriller. Definitely an enticing story, and I'm just overjoyed at this news. I'm really, really excited for it, and I guess we all have some waiting to do. The first issue isn't released until November 7th. Outstanding. Now all we need is a deck of cards. Thank you very much for watching today, guys, and for tuning into the channel. I've been sick for pretty much the first half of July, which sucks, but I'm starting to feel better, so hopefully I'll have some new videos for you guys up really soon, so stay tuned for that. And until next time, this is Alien Theory, signing off.